Hi, this is Lauren Dar, and I am here with celebrity groomer Jorge Vendersky. And we are at Global Pet Expo where you've just had a fabulous press conference to introduce your DIY dog grooming book. <laughs> and for the people that want to know, this is Tito the Palm, right? Correct. And Tito has a Twitter handle. Yes, it's at Tito the Palm. <laughs> he has a lot of followers, I think, right? Oh, yes. <laughs> So, Jorge, tell us about your book and your collaboration with Wall. Well, my book is about enhance, making your relationship with your dog better. more we learn about the dogs, our dogs, we become better pet owners. So I believe that there's plenty of books about everything else but grooming. And grooming is one of the strongest ways to bond with your dog. You know, mama monkey grooms baby monkey and that's how love is is in the air so you know that's what that's the core of, of my book is make owners a better pet owners true knowledge that's fantastic and you're here at the wall booth so tell me a little bit about um, wall and um, what you're doing in collaboration with them because you have some programs going on is that correct yes I'm so happy to team up with wall not only because they have some Terrific new products, the wall home products like this no rinse shampoo. This turned any paper towel into the best dog wipe for little accidents, for last minute touch ups, for that dirty butt or those <laughs> muddy paws. I love it. So, you know, it's like on the go grooming. And I'm all about teaching you how to keep your dog in shape in between grooming appointments. So their products, the deodorant, the other neutralizers, the new wipes, they all smells very natural. So I'm loving. And we are teaming up together. Actually, they invited me to be part of one picture safe a life initiative where I'm going to be teaming up with a famous photographer to go around the country, go to shelters, and, and give the dogs a makeover to give them a clean start on their journey to find their forever homes, clean with fabulous pictures. So That sounds fantastic. So I'm asking people at the show one question in particular, and that is, what patterns are you seeing overall in pet fashion or the pet industry in general? I believe that the pet industry is turning on the beauty industry applied to pets. Uh, that is not longer just the pet industry. It's like the beauty industry applied to pets. We see in products that they resemble high-end human products that they are made for dogs from, uh, you know, temporary glitter tattoos to non-toxic nail polish to all kind of facial wipes for dogs and, and very natural shampoos. You know, it's everything is kind of merging. It's almost the same products that we find at the best at Sephora. We will find it at, at a pet supply store. Fantastic. Thank you for your time. And I am so excited and glad that Tito was thrilled to do this interview with us today. He's what do you thrilled. say, Tito? <laughs> he wa he give you the, the, the wagging tail of approval. All right. Thank you, Jorge. You're welcome. <laughs>